first time magsasabay ang tatlong Filipino Kiwis sa isang laro sa New Zealand NBL. Ito ang mga teammates na sila Francis Mulvihill at Kenneth Duffin kontra sa nag-iisang Filipino Kiwi sa Otago Nuggets na si Richie Roger. Kaya tinawag ang larong ito na Filipino Night. Kamusta mga bro? Welcome ka rito. Maraming salamat sa pag-like at sa pag-subscribe sa Basketball PH Review. It's Filipino Night here in the NBL Showdown as we have a look at the Nuggets starting five. And Richie Roger, number 10 who is a student over in the Philippines, the University of the East. Roko has been one of the top scorers in the competition. Two players with Filipino links in this team as well, Francis Mulberhill and Kenneth Tuffin. Jordan Hunt wearing number 15, who will contest the tip for Otago the other night as well. So it's cutting all around on this Nugget side. Vincent has all around skill set. He's always had so many skills as a basketball player, but now he's got the belief to use them. There's Tuffin putting the floater up with his left hand. Down that goes. There's two apiece. Kyle on the driving at Tuffin. Oh, good defense from Tuffin. He saves defender. the ball as well. Very solid defender. Kenneth Tuffin. We've mentioned it before, but it is Filipino night, so I'll mention again. A member of the wider training squad, the Filipino national team, which is of course led at the moment by Paul Black, great Mark Dickel. Really ramping up as Jordan Arte. A lot of life. Oh, think about shooting that three instead of dropping off to Aitchison. And there's Roger, who steps into a three of his own, and that one goes down, Richie Roger. Man, that nice awareness by the Nuggets. This is for the triple. Mulverhill goes round Roger and finishes. I get it to go, but Jones will get the rebound. Stuffin prevents it going over halfway. Shoots a three of his own. He gets it to go, and the buckets are falling here. Triples galore. He'll get his first shot to drop, tucking the other way, one-on-one -on -one with Heyman. Strength, ooh, <laughs> power as he works his way through to the line and the bucket counts. Oh, Benoit Heyman, <laughs> unlucky on that possession. Tuffin just bows straight through him. Look at this, just get out of my way. Heyman, not a lot he could do there. But Tuffin created the contact, adapted to the contact with the finish. And was Tom Adanovich, the leading scorer in the competition. He of 10 threes in one game. Starting. Mulverhill gets both nuggets up in the air and finishes. Cool finish from the youngster. So Jones, Mulverhill goes the other way. He's quick and he finishes nicely. Up to nine. Then Richie Roger on the wing. Down it goes to Richie Roger. Another three for the Otago Nuggets. Um, you know, it was Philippines for hello. So, uh, you know, basically, um, yeah, I was really happy with how they went. Just a little fine things and connections and stuff uh, probably could have done a bit better in terms of that but yeah you're right but Kenneth Tuffin and Richie Roger or sorry Richard Roger coming out not Richard Roger Kenneth Tuffin and Francis Mulvihill coming out and really scoring well for the Taranaki Mountaineers in that first quarter I mean they've, they've got decent players right across the floor and you know Ken obviously plays a lot of decent basketball over in the Philippines and so uh, yeah they're pretty special in terms of the way they play so we got to make sure we're executing a lot better than that Coach, we know it's been a, a tough few days for you and those closest to you, and you're wearing the breast cancer awareness ribbon tonight. Talk us through that. You know, we might go into punches and stuff, so that's that talk about that gap. Okay? So be aware of that. But the key thing is getting on the board, getting out and running. And sorry, 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 you're that cheap? Oh, Ball. Nasai goes the other way, steps into Kenneth Tuffin. Oh, my. Who may be unlucky as Doug Corley just about <laughs> sprints out the gym in frustration. Well, the calls are not going the way of the Mountaineers right now. Let's toughen. That's great defense. That is great, great defense. <laughs> and that is uh, an unfortunate call against him. You guys uh, be able to slow down the Nuggets in the second half and find a little consistency, especially against Naitai, who really got hot in the second quarter. Uh, I think we need to slow down our offense. We're rushing into our offense, taking early shots, and they can get on the break and just have their way with us. And yeah, that's about all, I think. Well, it's a good way to start. Good luck in the second. 46-39, the first half's gone the way of the Otago Nuggets. Go out there and do what you do best. Yeah, that's it. You know, we're hugely grateful and um, real happy that we've got the chance to be able to play. And um, basketball is probably similar. Should be one of the most off-said sentences in NBL Showdown 2020. Oh, good oh, step through. Kenneth Tuffin gets a couple of nuggets up in the air. And just, he's got that physical game. 
it into Shane Temeter, who has a mismatch. And Jerry Kenny marking him. But the double is floating around. Tuffin for three. Over Jordan Hahn, and he gets that to go. Kenneth Tuffin. 15 points for him now. Shots as good as a, a made bucket right now because they're getting it right back. Hi, Wynn. Nice as Mulver Hill. There he is. Drops it up to Jones. We'll look for back to back threes. No, he won't. He'll find Mulver Hill. Good patience from Marcel Jones, and it works out for the Mountaineers. Well, the countdown energy and enthusiasm that I think really turned the game around. For Taranaki. Kick ball. Kenneth Tuffin. Look at that second half from the Taranaki Mountaineers after a relatively even first half. Yeah, certainly that third quarter. Mulverhill shapes to shoot. Slides against it. Nine seconds on the shot clock. 20 on the game clock. It's the Taranaki Mountaineers will go three and two with a big win over the Otago Nuggets. And even bigger now, thanks to Francis Meyer. Strong Mountaineer in the second half. 107-81.